Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Maze of Troll Tips and Tricks. If this is your first time here, my name is Phil, and I teach people how to set up and run a Mazex CNC lathe while programming it with Maze of Troll. If you have suggestions for future videos, or if there is something special you want to see, be sure to let me know down in the comments. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick and dirty way to check center line of your tool holders using the tool probe. This X geometry number is needed for setting a drill bit or end mill in the Mazak. I do not own a special coax indicator designed for this purpose, but the method I'm going to show you will get you within a few thousandths of the actual number. Again, this is not the method to get you the exact center line, but it will be close enough to get you going and you can fine tune it from there. All right, let's get started. All right, in order to set the center line of the machine, we're going to use a boring bar that's already in the machine to help us do that. And so what I want to do is probe the back edge of the boring bar in the machine. So I'll push the down arrow. Alright. Alright, so turn off the tool probe now that we've probed the back of the boring bar. So now what we need to do is manually minus the boring bar diameter off of the tool geometry. So we're, we're going to make this negative number bigger. So it's going to be minus 16.8498. So that is our center line for the boring bar station. And what we're going to do is write that number down for our future reference so we don't have to measure it every time. And again, this isn't perfect, but for most drills that are bigger than a quarter inch in diameter, it really, it won't make it that big of a deal. So now what we need to do, now that we got our number, we need to reprobe the boring bar so we don't crash the boring bar. We only use the boring bar as a measuring aid, but we need to reset the probe and reprobe X on the boring bar so it runs correctly. Let's do that now. Tool set, tool measure. Done with the probe. And that's how to set X geometry using the tool probe. Again, it's not perfect, but it'll get you close. If you like what you see, go ahead and push that subscribe button and click the bell so you won't miss any videos we have coming out. Also, if you guys have suggestions for future videos, please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.